and featuring more than 60 artists from around China, the exhibit at the Inchuan Contemporary Art Museum has kicked off, paying tribute to China, what China calls its Mother River. 66 artists from around the country have their work on display. They come in various forms, paintings, sculptures, installations, and photographs. Among the exhibitors is mixed-media artist Li Qiang. He uses pages of books and magazines to create layers and textures until his desired image is achieved. This shows a group of female figurines from the Tang Dynasty holding different musical instruments. The accumulation of paper generates a rhythm of power which cannot be created by other materials. I think each layer represents a segment of history. While I was working, it was like creating a fragment of the Yellow River's history. Fan Dian has made it a tradition to visit the Yellow River in the winter. For consecutive years now, he watched the sun rise over the river on the first day of each new year. Standing on the side of the Yellow River feels like standing in an open freezer. All the pigments are frozen. With that kind of feeling, I was able to create this painting showing how ice flows and crushes into the Yellow River. Liu Jiechun is the daughter of paper-cutting master Gao Fenglian. Her fascination for the technique grew, watching different shapes emerge from her mother's hands. She calls this 10-meter-long piece the soul of the river. Every Lunar New Year, women would gather, sing songs, and cut paper flowers. Colorful pieces would be pasted on windows across a whole village, as if they were a display of their best wishes in life. Wu Bo grew up by the Yellow River. His work began from fetching water from the river he's grown to become very familiar with. The Yellow River has slowly penetrated all aspects of my life. There will be some conflicting values between our generation and our father's generation. And this kind of thinking inspired my work. Water from the Yellow River penetrates the paper slowly, and it reaches a state where it cannot be written on or torn apart. This expresses the kind of emotion in my heart. The artworks not only reflect the river's appearance and surroundings, but also praise for its spirit. From traditional to contemporary techniques, these works about the Yellow River make the exhibit an epitome of Chinese art history. I think it's our responsibility to tell the Yellow River story by way of art. The Yellow River is known as the spiritual totem of the Chinese nation, a representation of the character of its people, diligent, perseverance, and indomitable. Ding Xie, CGTN.